Hello everyone, in this video, I'll show you how to fix no device drivers were found error while installing Windows 11, 10, 7 or 8. So let's get started. To fix this error, you'll need to open the command prompt. First, close the error window. After that, close the next window as well by clicking yes to quit. Now, click on the option repair your computer. You will then see a blue screen. Click on troubleshoot then select Command Prompt. Now, let's start by typing a few commands. The first command is Disk Part and press Enter. Next, type List Disk and press Enter. At this point, you will see a list of disks. In my case, Disk 0 is my main hard drive, a 120 GB hard drive in my laptop, and Disk 1 is my USB pen drive, 8 GB. You need to select your main hard drive, which is disk 0. So, type the next command, select disk 0 and press enter. Now, disk 0 is the selected disk. Type the next command, clean and press enter. Then type create partition primary to create a partition and press enter. You should see the message, disk part succeeded in creating the specified partition. Now, type the next command, which is the final one. Format fs equal sign ntfs quick and press enter. Disk part has now successfully formatted the volume. Type exit and press enter. Type exit again and press enter. Now, restart the installation of your operating system. Turn off your PC and start the installation again. Click next, then install now. At this point, your hard drive should appear. In my case, it's a 120 GB hard drive. Select your hard drive and click on Delete, then click OK. Now select the unallocated space and click on New to create a partition. Click Apply, then OK. The partition has been created. Finally, click Next to install your operating system. That's it. Your Windows installation should now proceed smoothly.